this way at me. My name is Mrs. Smout, and I'm a visitor here at your school today. And your teacher said you wanted to work with, do some things with kindergartners, and your teacher said, I have the best kindergartners in the whole world. You can work with my kindergartners. So that's why I got to come in here today to do a fun activity with you. I'm going to go ahead and start and tell you what I'm going to do. Today, I, can I have everybody looking at me? Right here. Thank you. I wish I knew names. Um, sweetheart, what's Kevin. 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 Can you can look at me for thank you, sweetheart. All right. Today, I'm going to hear syllables and blend them together to make words. A syllable is a part of a word. Being able to hear syllables and blend them together to make words is important in learning how to read. Also, it's like a secret code. Yeah. Mm. When I was little, my parents sometimes wanted to keep things secret from me. So they might say, when you go to the store, I want you to get some pan cakes. I wasn't really sure what they were talking about. But then I realized if I could blend the syllables together, I could figure out what they were saying. So when they said, I want to eat pan D for dinner, I would know that that was their secret code for candy and I would be excited. Or if they were thinking about going to the playground, then I could say yes, 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 because I really would want to go to the playground. My parents couldn't trick me. So I'm going to tell you now how I learned the secret code. I have to listen for the syllables, blend them together, and think about which word it sounds like when the syllables are blended. I'm going to say the first syllable, that's play. And then the next syllable, that's ground. Then I have to blend them together quickly to make it sound like a word. Play, ground, play, ground, play, ground, play, ground. Playground! That's a real word, isn't it? Playground. So now I know that that's right. All right, I'm going to try another one. Here's another one. Kevin. Ooh, I said the first sound. I got to listen and do it again. Kevin. Now I have to do it faster to make it sound like a word. Blend it together. Kevin. 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 Is there a Kevin? There's a Kevin in here. There's Kevin right there. Yes, absolutely. All right. Let's try another one. I'm going to try another one. Ready? I'm going to try sounds. Rider. Okay, I've said the sounds, and I have to say them and listen and slide them together, blend them together. Rider. 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 Are you Rider? Oh, there's Rider. All right. Well, now, um, so that's what we have to do. We have to say the first one. Let's try another one. Okay, here's the other one. The parts are Lee. You say the first part with me. Lee. The next syllable is Jen. You say the parts with me. Jen. Now let's slide them together, blend them together. Legion. Let's do it faster. Legion. Legion. Is there some? Is that you? Are you Legion? It's really fast and strong. They're really fast. All right. I wonder if we can do it when there are even more parts. Okay, I'm going to try one that's even bigger. Listen to this. Uh, Lex, uh. I have to try it. Ready? Can you do it with me? Yeah. Say it with me. Alexa. 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 Is that you? Are you Alexa? I could do it even with bigger ones. I'm going to try even another bigger one. Ready? Listen to this. I'm going to listen for all the syllables. Vic, Tor, E, A. Uh. So we have to listen to the sounds. Can you say them with? You say them with me and listen with me. And say them with me. Vic. Tor e a. All right, we have to say them a little bit faster. Victoria. Even faster. Victoria. Is that you? That's your Victoria. <laughs> you guys. I think you have figured out my secret code. So now I'm going to let you try and do it um, by yourself. All right. I'm going to tell you a story. So when I'm telling your story. When I want you to listen for some syllables or some parts, I'm going to put my hand to my ear like this. So when you see me put my hand to my ear, I want you to put your hand to your ear like this and listen very carefully to the parts. And then 
after we've listened to the parts, I'm going to point to you, and when I point to you, you say the word you've blended together. Okay, you try that? This is the story. My daughter and I love to go to the zoo. And she's even all grown up and goes to college now, but we still love to go to the zoo. And the last time we went to the zoo, I was so excited because the first animal that we got to see was, ready to listen? Who's got their hands up there ready to listen? The first animal that we got to see was a lion. You say the word. Lion. 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 Did you get it? All right, good job. We're going to try another one. Then, after we saw the lion, we went and saw the, ready to listen? Yes. Tiger. Tiger. All of you, all together. Tiger. 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 There you go. So when I point, I'm actually use two fingers. When I point like this, that means you can all tell me the words you figured out, okay? All right. We also saw, are you ready? The hip. Hippopotamus. 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 And my very favorite is the giraffe. Yeah. Yeah. Ooh, I don't know. Did we see that one again? Listen again. Giraffe. Yeah. Okay, I think we got it that time. Giraffe. Yes, the giraffe. Oh. And then, because I love horses, I'm always excited to see the zebra. Zebra! The zebra. And the funniest animal to see is the monkey. Monkey! Yes, the monkey is so funny to see. But one animal that I didn't get to see, that I was kind of sad, was I didn't see a... Rhinoceros. Rhinoceros! I didn't get to see a rhinoceros. Oh, I didn't get to see a rhinoceros. That means they sad. have a horn. They do have a horn. That's why I wanted to see one. All right. Well, so when we blend syllables, we listen for each syllable and then quickly blend them together to make a real word. So I want you to tell your neighbor what we listen for. Turn to your neighbor and say, We listen to syllables. Then we quickly blend the syllables together. Yeah. So tell your neighbor what we do after we listen for the syllables. Say we quickly blend them together. All right. Now, that was so much fun. I have another a friend with me that wants to come do an activity with you, too. So while she's coming up, will you stand straight up? Stand up. Will you jump up and down three?